Okay, everybody, check this out. This is what I'm talking about. This is Shy Girl, okay? And Shy Girl is almost, um, you know, vertical here, right? And um, so the last few days, she has been acting crazy. And, uh, and here she is here, okay? She just kept trying to climb over that. She's been humping the other tortoises. And now this is the first time I've ever seen her do this, okay? She's, you know, there she goes, okay? And uh, so what's going on? So what's going on, I know from experience, everybody, is that she is wanting to lay eggs, okay? Um, and she is just not gonna rest until she does, all right? So we've had a lot of eggs from Shy Girl over the last year almost, even though she mated with a male named Shelly. Check out that playlist. Shelly's now on a 30-acre horse ranch, okay? And she just keeps laying eggs, all right? And uh, this kind of behavior, if you have a female African sulcata or, um, you know, a female tortoise and they just start exhibiting really strange behavior, okay? Getting up super early, um, getting up in the middle of the night, all kinds of things, bouncing off the walls, all right? It's uh, most likely because she is looking to lay eggs, okay? And here in tortoise land, she has laid eggs. We give her spaces to lay eggs, right? Like right here, this is where she's laid a lot of her eggs, all right? So this has been a pretty successful place for her, but she doesn't seem to be interested in that, all right? And then we also have this area under here. This is where she used to like to lay her eggs, okay? In fact, over here at the end, she laid a bunch of eggs um, several months ago now, and uh, we just kept them in the ground, okay? just to see if they would hatch on their own, all righty? Will they hatch? Uh, we don't know, but uh, they're here. Okay, this is beautiful Digger that's born right here in tortoise land, just like Shy Girl, all righty? Everybody, Kevin, tortoise guy. So what's gonna happen here? What's happening? I am going to put fresh soil over here at this place, okay? Because a lot of times the fresh, moist, organic soil comes from Kellogg, this is the kind we get, okay? It's moist, it allows uh, it allows your tortoise to dig and actually the hole, you know, that they that they dig stays in the shape they dig it because if the soil is too dry, it won't do that, you know, already. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna prepare that area for her again, you know, ready? And get her in there, get her relief and hope she lays eggs for her own sake, okay? We don't need any more babies, God knows. We got her baby soaking right here. That's right. And if you're interested in our rehoming program, you just reach out to the tortoise guy Kevin at gmail.com. Check this out, the four little surprise babies. Look at, there's the littlest one. Hi, little dude. Hi, little dude. These are Shy Ghost kids right here. Okay, and we got our two beautiful red foots growing really big. Okay, that's pretty cool. And we got Marge the marginated tortoise. That was a gift to me. Okay, all told, 49 tortoises, 49 babies. Okay, so we're looking to rehome them, everybody. The tortoise guy Kevin at gmail.com. And we're looking to give some relief to Shy Girl. She's a beautiful tortoise. And uh, you know, someday soon, um, we're gonna see if we can get her a new home on a big piece of property, okay? We just are in the process of doing that to Lumpy. Check out the live stream we just did yesterday up at a ranch where Lumpy is going to be rehomed to after 18 years here in Tortoise okay? So, Shy Girl, as much as I want you to stay, it's time for you to spread your wings, girl.